They came early. Some of them woke up at 5.15 this morning to be here. Fifteen years ago, I decided that I wanted to become a teacher. And I started, I cut my teeth um, teaching at a classical school. I had gone to the University of Dallas and had done the Great Books program there and knew that I wanted to teach at a classical school. And after about five, six years at a classical school, I became Catholic. And I began to look around at the school that I was teaching at and I realized all of the things that we were teaching were actually Catholic uh, tradition. And I thought, I really want to be at a Catholic school teaching what I'm doing and, and, and doing what I love. And so then I moved to a Catholic school here in, here in town. I won't say which one. But then I was disappointed by how there was a, a lack of um, integration of the faith and the learning that I, I knew was so important. And about that same time, I heard about Mount St. Michael. Mount St. Michael is one of the only classical and Catholic schools in the Metroplex and has been since 1986, um, at least, right? And Mrs. Montgomery, who was principal at the time, had recruited me and told me about this fine campus. And I came on campus and I interviewed with Mrs. Montgomery. And I excused myself at some point, I went to the bathroom and started weeping because it was everything that I had dreamed of was this place. And ever since then, I have been teaching 7th and 8th grade humanities classes um, and religion and have been able to share my faith and my love and passion for history and for literature to um, the students here at Mount St. Michael. It is a wonderful place. It's like a little jewel in the middle of Dallas. Not too many people know about it. We kind of like it that way, but we're, we're starting to spread the news um, at how special this place is. I want to ask um, the eighth, seventh and eighth graders, what is the, uh, the virtue of the quarter that we've been studying? <laughs> they had to think for a second. Responsibility. So one of the things we do here is we teach virtue and we, we look at uh, the different things that we're learning and we look at through the lens of virtue and we have a different one every quarter. So this last one has been about responsibility and the students have definitely shown that today and so I'm very proud of them. Thank you so much for coming. And